Genesis 21, 1-21, Overview and Meaning, verses 1-7, The Birth of Isaac. Summary. The passage begins with the fulfillment of God's promise to Abraham and Sarah. Despite their old age, Sarah miraculously gives birth to a son, Isaac, at the exact time God had promised. Abraham, following God's instructions, names the child Isaac and circumcises him on the eighth day. Meaning, Isaac's birth is a testament to God's faithfulness and his power to fulfill his promises, even when circumstances seem impossible verses 8 to 14. Hagar and Ishmael sent away. Summary. As Isaac grows, Sarah notices Ishmael, Abraham's son by Hagar, mocking Isaac. Concerned about Isaac's inheritance, Sarah insists that Abraham send Hagar and Ishmael away. Though distressed, Abraham is reassured by God that Ishmael will also become a great nation, because he is Abraham's son. Abraham then sends Hagar and Ishmael away with provisions. Meaning, this part of the story highlights the complexities of human relationships and the consequences of decisions made outside of God's original plan. However, it also shows God's mercy and provision as he continues to care for Hagar and Ishmael despite the difficult circumstances. Verses 15 to 21. God's provision for Hagar and Ishmael. Summary. Hagar and Ishmael wander in the desert until their water runs out. In despair, Hagar places Ishmael under a bush, unwilling to watch him die. But God hears Ishmael's cries and sends an angel to comfort Hagar, promising that Ishmael will become a great nation. God then opens Hagar's eyes to a well of water, saving their lives. Ishmael grows up in the wilderness, becoming an archer, and Hagar finds him a wife from Egypt. Meaning, God's intervention in this desperate situation shows his compassion and care for all people, even those on the margins. It reassures us that God hears our cries and provides for us, even in our darkest moments.